Over the years, I've noticed parents that were very pro uh, children, their own children more specifically, in that they would do ceremonial things, I guess you can say for lack of a better word or expression, to their children, such as uh, piercing the child's ear before the child was old enough to make the decision as to whether or not they wanted their ears pierced. This has been male children and female children whose ears have been pierced by parents. For the most part, it's the mother that makes this decision to put holes in her little daughter's ears because she thinks it's cute. Or one earring in her baby boy's ear. Now this happens around the age of maybe uh, one year for the most part from what I've noticed and what I've gathered and some dads you know especially if the dad is sporting a single uh, diamond type earring or what have you he will elect to put an ear ring of course he has to pierce the child's ear first and then he puts an earring in his little boy's ear sometimes too around that age of one to five years old but my question is this why should we not allow our children the opportunity to decide whether or not they want holes poked in their bodies now I'm from the old school I never uh, believed in earrings for men that's me and with that said I would never pierce my male children's ears I don't care if it was a fad fashion or the style whatever you want to refer to it as and I definitely would not have pierced my daughter's ears when they were just small children I believe that that's a choice or decision that they must make themselves when they are of age to say well daddy or mom uh, is it okay that I get my ears pierced it's not our choice now if we were living uh, in a nation a country a culture perhaps uh, Africa, India somewhere and that was a custom or a cultural thing perhaps but we in America excuse me give your child the opportunity to grow up and to view the world and to make their own decisions and determinations based on how they see the world and culture for that matter and don't decide for them it's that child's choice. That's the same to me or akin to you putting a tattoo on your child, a permanent tattoo, at the age of one or two. What right do you have to do that? Do you think just because you are the parent, you have a right to mark up your child's body? I mean, you came into this world without it. So why are you doing it? Could we say ego, maybe? Uh, could you say that you're trying to uh, impress someone with your child wearing, uh, you know, these new earrings? Does it make the child look handsome if it's a male and cute or beautiful because it's a daughter? I think not because I think the baby is beautiful regardless of the outward adornment, if you will, or the embellishment. So all I'm simply saying is this. Stop putting holes in your children's ears, their noses, or wherever, just because you think it's cute. That's that child's decision, or should be that child's decision, when they are of age, not yours, because you think it's cute, or you're trying to impress yourself or someone else. What do you think about this? Now, let's say, if you were older, and you were 16 years old and you didn't have pierced ears or you were 20 years old or 30 years old and someone walked up to you grabbed you set you down in the chair and just pierced your ears excuse my expression but wouldn't you be pissed of course you can articulate and you can express your feelings and you can tell people how you how you feel and what your thought is about it because you feel like you've been violated because of something maybe you don't want. 
Just because your child cannot express their feelings and articulate those same feelings as a young child, does it still give you the right to do it? Not at all. This is Brother Teacher. What do you really think?